up guys I'm gonna show you all my poor man's kayak it's an apex 100 from pelican it's a 10 foot yak you know when i bought this i was a little you know budget conscious i didn't want to drop a whole lot of money you know i just want to get in the water have some fun um a little bit of upgrades you can see here you know got my crate got my little cooler that's accordion style so i'm not using it, it actually you know saves me a lot of space I got my little plano box there with some tackle, you know. Got two rod holders, you know. Back there, another two up here that I put. Got these at Bass Pro, you know, they work pretty good. Um, pretty cheap, 18 bucks, got both of them. And they do rotate so I can flip them up to the side. They turn 180 degrees, so that's good. You know, got myself a little paddle. Haven't uh, gotten myself the uh, paddle keeper yet, which goes right here. Um, I really don't see a need for it as of now when I usually go fishing I like to dangle my legs off the side so usually I just put this right here and then you know have my leg over it and it won't go anywhere and if it does I have it you know attached to the string that way it uh, doesn't go anywhere here you know when I first got this kayak I made the mistake of getting myself the little the little anchor now this little anchor does work pretty good on uh, you know calm very calm water so you hardly drift or you drift for a little you know like to fish off the flats and it's all dirt and sand so if there's a lot of wind you know it's not going to grip onto anything and it's just going to move me so what i did i already had these little you know weights for my uh, uh, dumbbell some dumbbells that i had so the good thing about this is that i can alternate let's say if there's going to be a lot of wind you know i'll keep both of these stacked 10 pounds if there's not so much wind i'll take one off save myself some five pounds um because again this kayak is a 10 footer you know I'm, I'm a little on the heavy side and i have to keep it under 250 i weigh about two 220 so you know i'm always kind of like on the weight conscious plus the less weight the better let's go around here i'm a little flag so i can tow it for my truck and back here, you know, I found this uh, this little bungee cord here at one of my fishing spots, you know, just thrown there, so, you know, washed it out, found good use for it, hooked it up to these two eyelids, and when I'm happier, my fish grips. So, you know, I can have my fish grips way back here, you know, in the box or back there stored, or I can just have it hanging here when I, once I catch a fish, you know. That way I hook them up, see that the fish doesn't go anywhere. I could just leave them on the side, use it, use it like a stringer. Um, you know, keep on fishing in case I land another one on one of the other rocks, you know. That's uh, pretty much it for my kayak. One thing I do want to add in the future is probably some eyelids up in the front. So I can have a, a, a anchor trolley. That way I can adjust myself to the fishing. Because sometimes it does get kind of annoying not being able, not facing the way you want to face, you know, when you're fishing. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions on my setup, once again, all this probably cost me less than three hundred dollars and the kayak is brand new uh, just go ahead and send me a message comment below and i'll try to get back to you guys as soon as possible thank you for watching have a great day